Hello everyone, in this video we are going to determine the relative maximum and relative minimum value of a function. By definition, relative maximum refers to the peak in the graph, or pretty much like the top of a hill, while the relative minimum is the bottom in the graph, or the lowest point in the valley. So let's take this first example right here. So we're going to determine what is the relative maximum value and the relative minimum value for this. Please remember that the value that we're referring to both relative maximum and relative minimum, the value that we're referring to is the y value. So as you can see here, this is the valley that we're talking about and this is the hill that we're talking about. If we find the relative maximum value for this, I'm just going to write max value for this. Again, when we talk about the maximum value and minimum value, we're looking for the y value. So in this case right here, the max value for this would be 2. So I'm just going to go ahead and write that the max value for this is 2. The minimum value for this is the lowest point right here. So that should be negative 3. Sometimes we can um, write the relative maximum value and the relative minimum value in terms of coordinate. Or we can again rewrite this as for this problem right here, the maximum value. This is at point 0.32. So you can go ahead and write this is at point 0.32. 3, 2, or the minimum value is negative 2 and negative 3. Either notation would be correct. Again, first notation that we have here refers to the y value, while the other notation that we have here is the point. So this point right here and this point right here. So this point is the maximum and this point is the minimum. At this time, I would encourage you to pause this video and try this problem out on your own. And when you're done and pause it and check your answer. Okay, from here we can label the um, the maximum and the minimum. So right here, this is a maximum. This is a minimum. This is a maximum and this is a minimum. Again, there are two ways to uh, represent the maximum value. It's either by the y value or the point. So let's take the maximum value. So I'm just going to write max value. So the uh, values that we can have would be that would be on three. And then we also have a maximum at well, the maximum value of 2. And then for the minimum value, there are two minimum value for this, um, a negative 1, and the other minimum value is negative 4. Again, we are talking about the y value. The other notation that we can have is using the point, so that would be or for this. So the first maximum value would be at point negative 4 and 3. And the other um, maximum value would be at 1, 2. So that's 1, 2. Well, the other hand, the minimum value, the first minimum value as a point is negative 1 and negative 1 and the other minimum value as a point is 3 negative 4. Again, both notations are correct. Again, the first notation is the y value of the maximum or the y value of the minimum point while the other notation is the point. So this one right here is the uh, maximum point. This is another maximum point and this is a minimum point, and this is a minimum point. Did you get the same answers as this? Good, perfect. If you found this video helpful, hit like and subscribe for more math videos. See ya!